Hi, I'm Cleveland Karen Allegres. I'm 25 years old and I'm an open water swimmer. By profession, I'm a biologist and now I'm studying veterinary medicine at Southwestern University to further uh, pursue my advocacy in the marine aspect. I've been swimming since uh, I was in high school and I joined competition, uh, school competitions in college. After I graduated, I joined triathl triathlons, uh, aquathlons, like the Lango Challenge, h 2 Man, and other races. I enjoy swimming because it's really my passion and it's, it's an advocacy for me to spread, uh, to, to inspire fellow Okonganons. To record my swimming stats, uh, I use this Garmin 4Runner 935. It is a triathlon watch. I run, indoor, bike, bike indoor, pool swim, open water swim, duathlon, and triathlon. What I like about this watch is uh, the GPS of the swim is really precise. For me, lah, for me compared to the other four runners I have. Uh, can I? For runner 920 is uh, not so precise. The reading will uh, not as accurate as the 935. I swim to influence first our uh, neighbors here in Lapu Lapu City of the Okonganons. Uh, we are very lucky. We are lucky to have unlimited access to the ocean. Unlike in uh, other places like Cebu, all over the Philippines, we still need to drive how many hours to access the beach. Lapu-Lapu is a very small uh, island, prehistoric resort city, surrounded everywhere by water. So it's a, a great advantage for us to practice swimming, not just for, not just for our physical health, but also our mental health. It's very relieving every time I'm stressed in school, anywhere. Just jump in the water, swim, and feel the relaxing uh, vibe the water gives me. Uh, the sound of the waves, the splashes while swimming, and the serenity, the silence of the underwater. What motivates me to try to swim around Lapu Lapu City is my uh, my mother's challenge. When I told her my plan, she was laughing and told me uh, if, if I lost my mind, but I, I want to prove her next year, hopefully, I can do it. And my challenge really is self-discipline. Uh, as a as a 25-year-old uh, guy, there are a lot of temptation to vices like drinking, and uh, not practicing because of uh, other things, other stuff to do. This is really my uh, challenge right now. I swim every day. I train uh, as much as I can. And uh, as a as a swimmer of uh, Tribu Lapu Lapu, a triathlon group in in the city, I think if I can successfully do it do my my vision next year i'm the first i'm the first person to do it successfully hopefully <laughs> this will be a very challenging swim and uh, because uh rough estimated we estimated i will take up 42 kilometers and more or less the target to finish it uh for 16 to 20 hours uh, more or less what could possibly be the challenges number one uh Jellyfish, jellyfish. There are a lot of jellyfish in Lapu-Lapu during summer days, and building of the third bridge because we need to pass by Cordova, have access here in Maribago. Number three, the current, the changing current, uh, the weather. I uh, just pray that it will be a sunny and uh, lean out day for the swim. Currently, I'm training hard now. Next year, by 2021, I have a plan. 
It's my goal to circumnavigate an island next year. Motto in life, Hakuna Matata means no worries and just keep swimming. <laughs>